Lights, Camera, Action Everyone loves a good movie night. The relaxation, the enjoyment and entertainment. And especially the snacks. More importantly, the winter holidays are just around the corner, meaning nights around the television binging classic holiday movies are quickly approaching. And for watching your favorite holiday classics, I've packed a box filled with all of my absolute favorite all-time movie snacks. Can you guess what they are? I can give you a guess. Scotch tape definitely isn't one of the things in my box. Hi everyone, welcome back to Food Mystic, your one-stop shop for all things food. Today, I'm going to discuss some of the absolute best snacks to enjoy while watching your favorite holiday movies. I've packed a box full of my favorites, and it's your job to guess what they are. Think about it. What snacks come to your mind when you think about watching a movie? Before we begin, if you find videos like this interesting and informative, please go ahead and hit the like button. And more importantly, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Now take a moment to pause the video and get your guesses together. When you're ready, let's get into some of the best movie snacks. Starting our list of my favorite movie night survival snacks is a tried and true classic, potato chips. Did you know that the potato chip was almost found extinct after World War II? It's true. During the war, they were deemed as a non-essential food, and their production was halted by the government. Crazy, right? The nice thing about chips is the wide variety available. So, whether you're a fan of Doritos, Pretzels, Fritos, or plain old Lay's Originals, any local grocery store will have you covered. So, feel free to head to the chip aisle and shop to your heart's content. If you're like me, you're a sucker for a nice mixture of salty and sweet when you're knee-deep in a snacking mood. And while watching a movie is no different. Chips are a delicious, savory, salty option that will perfectly balance out the sweeter snacks that we'll get to in a moment. I, for one, am more than relieved that chips survived the war and can be included in my ultimate movie night snack box. Did you guess potato chips as a part of my box? If so, good job. If not, that's okay too. I'm sure you're bound to get a few of the next ones right. Now, let's get to snack number two. The second snack in my box is candy. Specifically, fruity candy. I'm talking about gummies, Sour Patch Kids, Twizzlers, take your pick. There might be no other snack that symbolizes watching a movie than fruity candy. And everyone has their favorite. Like chips, there are just so many candy options out there. So many that just about everyone can find one that they can call their go-to option when they're in need of something sweet. Like when watching a movie. Personally, I'm a big fan of Sour Patch Kids. I'm a person who enjoys a little sour tang with my sweet candy, so Sour Patch Kids hit just the spot. Those little sour sweet children make any film all the more pleasurable. Did you know that Sour Patch Kids were originally called Mars Men and were named in an effort to piggyback on the interest in space travel in the 70s? I'm sure glad that they changed their name. I can't imagine eating little spacemen. Did you guess candy? Nice, two for two. If not, that's okay. Let's keep it going with my third must-have movie snack. Oh, sweet, sweet chocolate. What would I ever do without you? The third snack in my box of movie-watching favorites is a dear old friend of mine. And a favorite of millions of people around the world. Of course, chocolate couldn't be left off my list of go-to movie snacks. And it's the next on our list. While many people nowadays view chocolate as an indulgent and unhealthy snack, there's actually plenty of evidence that, in moderation, chocolate, especially dark chocolates, have a myriad of health benefits, including heart health. All in moderation, of course, and I'm more than happy to eat some delicious treats in the name of a healthier heart if that's what it takes. Some of my absolute favorite chocolates to consume while watching a movie are Snickers bars, York peppermint patties, and Junior Mints. Something about a mix of chocolate and mint just goes hand in hand with watching a movie. And even better, if you balance out the chocolate with a salty snack, like the previously mentioned potato chips, your mouth is in for a wonderful experience. How many of you are 3 for 3? Now that we've covered my first love, chocolate, let's move on to the most anticipated and probably the highest guest snack option, popcorn. Snap, crackle, pop. No, I'm not talking about Rice Krispie Treats. I'm talking about the ultimate, hands-down favorite movie-viewing snack of all time, popcorn. Certainly this was on your list of guesses, right? The fourth snack in my box is popcorn. 
and popcorn and movies go together about as well as peanut butter and jelly. Did you know that once popped, popcorn kernels can increase to over 30 times their original size? Pretty cool, right? I personally love kettle corn to satisfy my needs for a bit of sweetness. But the basic salty and buttery option works just as well. As an added bonus, I like to sometimes add some M&M chocolates to my popcorn when it's nice and hot, slightly melting the chocolate and leading to an excellent salty and sweet combination in every bite. For as long as humans have had movies to enjoy, popcorn has been right there with them to provide them a snacking option while viewing. If you've gotten 4 out of 4 so far, you're doing great. There's just one snack left. Let's find out if you got them all right. Okay, so not quite a snack per se, but a movie viewing staple nonetheless rounds out our list and my box, and that is soda pop. While a healthier drink option like water might be a better decision in light of the caloric heavy options I've already included, it's just far too boring. Plus, drinking water with popcorn just leaves an awful buttery aftertaste in my mouth that leaves much to be desired. Soda, on the other hand, completes the taste profile gamut of my snack options and provides a delicious washing down of my salty and sweet snacks. While my favorite soda, Coca-Cola, is definitely not healthy by any means, it is oh so delicious. Plus, if you're watching your weight or just want to lower the calories while watching a movie, feel free to go for one of the many diet soda options available, such as Coke Zero, to trim that waistline and still spruce up your drink flavor profile. Plus, have you ever had soda with chocolate? Something about the two just goes so well, much like popcorn and chocolate. My box is filled with snack options that go well together and ensure that your movie viewing experience is filled with yumminess. And there you have it. We've reached the bottom of my snack box. As a review, my favorite go-to movie snacks for surviving the hours of mindless viewing are potato chips, candy, chocolate, popcorn, and soda. My mouth is watering just thinking about it. Feel free to stock up on these as you prepare for your holiday film binging in just a few months. Before we wrap it up, I'd like to take the time to go over some fun movie night snack ideas that are sure to wow your family or any other guests that may be joining in. These are perfect for the holidays, so make sure you pay close attention to the needed ingredients. While my box of yummy snacks is certainly delicious, these are some specialty snack ideas that are sure to please any palate they come in contact with. Holiday Salsa this mouth-watering mixture of cream cheese, cranberry, cilantro, and jalapeno is sure to put you right in the winter spirit. The jalapenos give it a nice kick, while the creaminess of the cream cheese and bittersweet complement of the fresh cranberries really ties it all together. Spread it out on your favorite dinner cracker for a great appetizer or snack. Candied Bacon-Wrapped Figs Bacon and fruit sounds like the perfect salty-sweet combination to pair with a holiday movie night. These flavorful bites cover the entire gamut, of savory and salty to sweet and delectable. And plus, it's bacon. Everyone loves bacon. Treat your family to some of these bites and they'll thank you forever. And if figs aren't your thing, you can use cherries or dates instead. We love versatility, and these bite-sized treats are sure to be a huge hit with others. Holiday Eggnog This one really doesn't need a whole lot of explanation. We all know and love that sweet, thick embrace of a heaping cup of eggnog. However, while you may not think it possible, there is a way to make eggnog even better. Alcohol. Specifically, I'm a big fan of equal parts rum and brandy, but there are plenty of recipes out there that call for a wide variety of fine liquors. Regardless of which way you decide to go, you're sure to produce a fun, social, and most importantly, delicious drink treat for yourself and guests. Next, holiday fruitcake. How could we leave this off? Everyone absolutely adores a good holiday fruitcake. Just kidding, of course. Skip the nasty fruitcake and be sure to instead consider making some of these. Chocolate-covered candy canes. Okay, now if this doesn't scream holiday snack, then I don't know what else will. We've already covered chocolate and we've established that it's one of my favorites. We've also discussed how satisfying the chocolate-mint combination can be, especially around the holidays. Simply heat and melt your chocolate of choice, I personally think basic milk chocolate works best for these, dip your peppermint sticks into the melted chocolate, and let them dry on wax paper. Voila! You've taken a boring old candy cane 
and turned it into a sweet treat that is the epitome of the holiday season. Enjoy the sweetness and the fresh breath you'll get from the peppermint. You've made it to the end of my list. Do you have any go-to favorite movie snacks that were left off my list? Or do you have a favorite amongst the snacks I've chosen? Also, what are your favorite holiday movie classics? I'd love to hear all about them in the comments below. And while you're at it, don't forget to turn on all notifications by hitting that bell icon, so you'll never miss more of the interesting food content like this that I'm constantly releasing. Once again, I'm Food Mystic, your number one source of interesting food chronicles. Until next time, I wish you and yours a wonderful and yummy holiday season.